In this week's meditation, we are going to do an emergence practice. For those of you that participated last week in the meditation, we will be using the results of that meditation. If you didn't do that meditation, you can go back and do it now first, or you can just continue with this meditation. It will have valuable information. So to begin the meditation, I just want you to really fill yourself in the room, connect with who you are here. Connect again with that rabbit hole, with the burrow. Remember how you felt after meditating last week. Connect with how you feel now. And relax into that place you were. Remember the very core level of that rabbit hole. Where you sat alone in the center of your being. What message did you receive there? Today we're going to explore the levels of expression and what it means to allow yourself to emerge from within your core and not be defined by outside influences. core level is a level I call our essence. It is the aspect of who we are that only we will ever understand. And even we will be in a constant exploration of it, a constant discovery. It's who we are beyond our identity, beyond form. You may call it your soul or your spirit. It is that intangible quality that makes you unique, that makes you not like anyone else. When you asked the question, who am I here to be? What was the answer of your essence? What does it mean to you that the answer you have here represents the essence of who you are? Can you connect to that? Can you connect to that answer that maybe no one else can comprehend about you? That has been pervasive in your life. Is there something you remember about yourself that you might have forgotten? You can pause the video and answer the question titled Essence in your practice for this week. As we begin to rise from the self and we look at our partner the next level where we went to our partner. The people we partner with in life tend to reflect the identity of who we are. This is the level I call expression. This is how we express that essence. It is generally the way we define ourselves in the world. Is there anything interesting that your partner offered when answering the question, who am I here to be? 
that reflected for you a level of expression that reminded you of who you are or that help you expand into a new way of being. You can pause the video and answer the question titled expression in your practice this week. As we rose from expression, we moved to the next level of our descendants. Our descendants represent what we want to create in this life. They are what we want to bring into the world, what we want to leave behind as our legacy. This is the level I call experience. This is where our expression, our identity, interacts with the world around us to create experience. Again, our essence rises up to expression, which then becomes our experience. What did you learn about your experience of life as you asked your descendants, who am I here to be? What awakened in you? What new possibility revealed itself to you? You can pause the video here to answer the question called experience in your practice. And finally, as we came to the last level of being, as we came to ourselves sitting as the meditator, how did you answer the question, who am I here to be? The natural expression of life is a ripple, continually beginning at our essence. As we pour that essence into expression, that expression becomes our experience. And that experience, moment by moment, day by day, becomes our existence. What is possible in your existence now after this meditation? That you may not have known was available. What is awakening in you now? In a moment, I will end the video so that you can go and answer the question about existence. But I would also like you to continue throughout the week to contemplate these levels, to contemplate who are you at the level of essence? How do you express that essence when you forget life's demands on you and connect with pouring out of you who you are? What experience do you have in life? How does that affect your existence? So again, we'll end the video so that you can answer the question for existence. And then there will be a final opportunity for the weekly contemplation of all these levels and what they mean to you 
and how they might change your perspective of how much power you have in your life, of how much impact and influence. So again, I want to leave you here to work on that this week. I hope this practice has inspired some new realizations for you. And I look forward to connecting with you along the way.